I wanted to show you guys a behind the scenes look of how we test our cold process soaps to make sure that it is done curing before we post it on our website so it can be available to you guys. Um, so here in front of me, I have two baby soaps. On the left hand side is our squash em soap, which is made with carrot and butternut squash. And then our right hand soap, our soap on our right hand side is our Nana Knows Best, which is made with calendula and banana milk. So, um, so um, I have a little bit of water right here on the side and then I have my pH tester strips. In order for us to know whether our soap is cured, it has to be between seven, eight, and nine. If it's past this olive looking color, that means it's too high and you have to let it sit for an additional week or two. So we're gonna put a little bit of dab of water on both of the soaps so we can be able to test them out. So just grab some water, tap it in a certain, in your desired area. And then right here, you circle it in. You can grab a little bit more if you want to. All right, so we got that. All right, so then we're gonna go ahead and grab our pH strips. What I normally do is instead of using a whole strip, I normally just get one. Normally get one and then I split it in half. And then I place it in the white area and I place it in the wet area where the where I made the wet spot. So I'm gonna go ahead and place this right here in that area. And I'm gonna go ahead and place this right here in this area. There we go. So we're gonna give it a minute for the pH tester sticks to dissolve the liquid so we can see whether our soaps are cured or not. I made these soaps at the beginning of March. So now we're in May. So normally it takes four to six weeks for the soaps to be ready. These are a simple recipe. It's olive oil, coconut, coconut oil, and Haitian castor oil. We'll give it a few minutes for the stick to dissolve. Okay, so the sticks are about done. So we're gonna take them off and lay it on our clear section. And lay it right there. Then we're gonna bring over our pH tester to see where exactly it lands. So for me, it looks like it's about an eight. Looks like it's about an eight. Definitely not a nine. So it's about an eight right now. And then we're gonna take a look at our next one over and it's about an eight. So it looks like both of our soaps are about ready to cure. Um, and then it should be posted on our website soon. Thank you very much for watching.